one of the big kind of do nots, but Philip, we, we hear this phrase a lot in, in our world, the phrase of helicopter parents who, again, as a helicopter, you're constantly circling around your student athlete or hovering. Um, but again, we see this in the world of, of sports and maybe more so now than ever before with parents being very invested. And it's awesome that parents are invested, but you need to find that balance between being too much of a helicopter parent um, and, and maybe hurting your student athlete's chances in the recruiting process. Absolutely. Don't be that parent. And if it wasn't simple enough, we've all seen that parent, maybe not even at a camp, but maybe at, at a game where, you know, there's a parent out there in a the crowd yelling, you know, obnoxiously, you know, whether it be yelling towards their personal student athlete, whether it be them yelling at the coach, you know, whether it be them yelling at the refs, you know, we see that even at the professional level. Here, as we're looking to get off to be recruited to college, don't be that parent, okay? That helicop helicopter parent phrase is something that college coaches look the other direction towards. As soon as a college coach can very much identify an overbearing parent, or maybe that's not even your attention. You know, maybe you just appear to be overbearing in a certain instance. That can be a big no-no for a college coach. And as soon as they're able to make that connection between, hey, this is that coach's parent or this is that student athlete's parent, they may look the other direction. And on that last token, okay, when it comes to college coaches, they may be anywhere, okay? They may be anywhere. They're not always going to be in uniform. They may not always be on a field with your coach. They may not always have something that represents their school. So the best bet is just to have, hold yourself to a higher standard as a parent and try not to be so overbearing because just because you're watching on the field, okay, where your student athlete is, it doesn't mean that a coach may not be right next to you observing how you actually hold uh, carry yourself amongst the duration of that event. And, and even it reflective of student athletes too, right? You talk about from the time you get out of your car in the parking lot, how, do, how does the parent, how do you treat your kid? How do you treat the coaches? How do you treat that? So again, it goes the whole way. I've heard stories about a student athlete yelling at their parents in the parking lot after a game and the coach crossed them off their list. So again, this is stuff that coaches are aware of this. Again, this is the coach's life, the college coach. This is their job is to recruit the right kids, not just the best athletes, but the right kids for their program. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Click the logo to subscribe to our channel and check out all the other videos on our page for all things recruiting.